Here we have a typical birthday candle, and you can see it's producing that typical very bright white light. And now we're going to light another type of candle, and let's see what happens. Well, we don't get that same type of flame. We're getting different colors from these different candles. They're not quite as bright, and they don't quite produce as big as flame. So with these different colors, well, how are we getting these different colors? Well, it's all about the chemicals that make up that candle. Elements in different chemicals burn at different colors, and that's how you can identify some of these chemical compounds. Well, what chemical can produce a green light? What chemical can produce a reddish light? Which one can produce an orangeous light? Well, we're going to do a flame test on a couple chemicals and take a look at what the possibilities might be. Into the petri dish, I'm going to scoop a little bit of strontium chloride. And strontium chloride, it's just a chemical that is white in color. And we're going to add some denatured alcohol to the dish. And that's going to be our fuel for burning so we can produce a very big flame. So we're going to light it. You can see it's a kind of a bluish flame. The bluish flame is from the alcohol, but the red is from the strontium chloride. Strontium chloride burns red in color. And it's a very bright red. It's kind of cool. The makers of fireworks have to have a very good knowledge base of what chemicals burn what colors. And so you get the different colors in these different fireworks, different kind of shininess, different kinds of sounds. And this petri dish is some copper sulfate. Copper sulfate is bluish in color, but when burned, it produces a very bright green flame. Now the more intense stirring produces more mixture of the copper sulfate with the denatured alcohol and that's where you get the really big flames. Um, sometimes the flames spill over into the countertop so just kind of be careful with that. Usually it burns off pretty quickly but you just always want to be careful in these types of demonstrations.